is News 3 Now, live at 4, moving forward. Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Live at 4 on this windy Friday afternoon mm -hmm. heading into the weekend. The risk of fire danger continues. The Wisconsin DNR is continuing to warn people as these conditions persist. The biggest risk right now is the high winds and the low humidity. On days like these, embers from any fire can easily drift and light up any exposed brush, which could lead to a wildfire. Let's take a closer look at the Wisconsin burn map. Every county in Wisconsin Wisconsin is currently at a moderate risk for fire danger. That risk is down from last week where much of the state was in high or very high risk. However, that doesn't mean the risk isn't there. Over the past week, the DNR responded to 122 wildfires burning nearly 340 acres, the most active week this season. The majority of these have been related to debris burning, which kicks up a lot of sparks, as we said, that can easily get out of hand. Wisconsin's wildfire season is expected to continue for several weeks, especially as pine trees start to lose moisture making fires easier to start. Even with the fire risk, it looks like it'll be freezing cold tonight. Chief Meteorologist Alex Harrington is here with your first warm forecast. Alex? Yes, Brady and Susan, you'd think cold temperatures. What's the danger with fire out there? Well, just as you said, wind gusts out there have been 30, 35, even wind gusts approaching 50 miles per hour over portions of southwestern Wisconsin since midnight today. So there's the wind. Relative humidity very low, 30 to 40 percent across all of southern Wisconsin. Those are the two ingredients that you need for fire and even though it's cold and even though we've had recent rainfall we still have dry fuels out there vegetation that's still dry from the late fall and the winter that hasn't had a chance to green up out there so we have the fire danger here in Madison we're only at 49 degrees that's the temperature you'd see at the end of March a strong west wind sustained at 16 miles per hour and you said freezing temperatures we could be looking at sub freezing meaning below 32 tonight for much of southern Wisconsin that's why we have freeze warm Mornings. In effect, for a good portion of southern Wisconsin, we'll be tracking just how cold those temperatures go coming up in one of my weathers. And in the other weather, a little bit later in our newscast, I'll be talking about one ingredient that could help keep that frost at bay. All right, Alex, we'll check back in just a little bit. We have breaking news today. A Janesville man is in custody in relation to a dead body that was found on Wednesday. Our Maddie Heimsch is at the Janesville Police Department where we just learned new details. 23-year-old Logan Barclay is now in custody facing the charge of first-degree intentional homicide. Barclay is a Janesville man with no criminal history here in Wisconsin. Janesville police say Barclay had previously been in a domestic relationship with the victim. This incident was not a random act of violence. This was a domestic relationship that soured and was isolated between two people. There are no community threats at this time. The victim was a 22-year-old Janesville woman. Janesville Chief of Police Chad Pearson says Barclay and the victim share a child. Police were called to Peace Trail Wednesday at 12.42 p.m. where they found the victim's body near South Afton Road and West Rockport Park Drive. On Thursday, police were able to identify the victim, speak to Barclay, and execute a search warrant at Barclay's residence where they found, quote, evidentiary items. Police are not identifying the victim at this time as the investigation is ongoing. Reporting in Janesville, Maddie Heimsch, News 3 Now. Well, the Biden campaign is continuing its run in Wisconsin. Vice President Kamala Harris will be in La Crosse this Monday. She'll be at an abortion rights event. The VP will then hold an event about the economy and health care. It's Harris's third trip to Wisconsin this year. The vice president was in Madison last month and Waukesha in January. A child was injured this morning after being hit by a car while trying to board a school bus. According to Dane County Public Safety Communications, the school bus stopped with its yellow and red lights activated when a vehicle drove past it, hitting the child as they crossed the highway. Luckily, the child only sustained minor injuries. That's according to the Dane County Sheriff's Department. Well, now to an update on the 2023 Labor Day peer collapse at UW-Madison. The university released a report today which concluded student behavior was a root cause of the collapse. In the incident summary report, investigators found the peer was put under more stress than it was designed for. Numerous warnings were given to the students at the time, but 
they persisted. The report also concludes all involved with staffing should take more care to staff lifeguards and safety personnel. There were no lifeguards on duty at the time of the collapse. The Environmental Protection Agency is designating two forever chemicals as hazardous. They are PFOA and PFOS. The designation gives the EPA greater authority to investigate and clean up sites polluted with them under the federal Superfund law. It also makes it easier for the EPA to force companies to pay for the cleanup. Forever chemicals, also known as PFAS, have been linked to a number of health issues, including cancer, heart disease, and reproductive problems. The CDC says they're found in the bloodstreams of nearly 97% of Americans. They're often used to help products repel water and oil, but they linger in the environment and the human body. Well, really quickly, I want to address an elephant in the room, that being the swollen part of my face. I had a little facial injury that required me to get stitches right here. I'm a little swollen, a little sore, so I may look a little different for the time being, but I'm fine. Don't worry, I'm healing very well, so. You are a trooper to do this. <laughs> Honestly, though, Brady, if you hadn't said that, I'll bet nobody would have even noticed. I think the beard might make a comeback. Yeah, maybe just bring a little a mustache. Little, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> no, thank you for doing thank this. Thank you. Well, coming up next on Live at Four, we're horsing around a little at the Midwest Horse Fair. We'll get Give you a look at one of the biggest horse events of the year coming up when Live at Four continues. Hey, Wisconsin neighbors, the best way to prepare for April showers is by upgrading your shower. Right now we're offering 50% off installation plus a free upgrade to our Jacuzzi Rainfall Shower Head. Change your outdated bathroom in as little as one day with the Jacuzzi Bath Remodel System. We bring the showroom to you and give you half off installation too. Many of our customers like Regina and Dennis were surprised at how easy and stress-free the process was. This has been a great experience. I can't even express it. And they <laughs> just excited. <laughs> the team actually set the expectation. We just can't wait to see the finished product. Oh, wow. oh my God. Oh, my God. I love it. Thank you, Jacuzzi Bath Remodel. Thank you. Oh, my God. I cannot wait. Oh, my God. I can't wait. <laughs> And Tundraland makes your project affordable with no money down, no interest, and no payments until 2025. Call 1-800-TUNDRALAND or visit tundraland.com today. At RG Heating and Air Conditioning, our promise to you is 100% satisfaction guaranteed. Guaranteed service, repairs, and replacements. Installing quality train equipment. Trust your home with RG Heating and AC. Shop from the largest selection of Chevy trucks and SUVs in Wisconsin at Bergstrom Chevrolet. All with Bergstrom's negotiation-free upfront pricing, including our exclusive seven-day price protection and money-back guarantees. Stop in or shop and purchase at bergstromchevrolet.com. Welcome to Badgerscape Design and Landscape. We offer a full range of landscaping services from design to maintenance. Our professional team is dedicated to meeting all your landscaping needs. Call us at 608-295-1446 or visit badgerscapedesignandlandscape.com. Salon Pass Lidocaine Flex, a super thin, flexible patch with maximum OTC strength lidocaine that contours to the body to relieve pain right where it hurts. And did we mention it really, really sticks? Salon Pass, it's good medicine. He sent me to elevate your look with Wisconsin Vision. Affordable luxury in every frame. A necessity for some, but suitable for every lifestyle. Nobody wants to replace the roof, but these days, many roofs are only lasting 10 to 15 years, costing you tens of thousands of dollars. RoofMax makes your roof like new by strengthening and rejuvenating it. RoofMax treatments started early enough can extend the life of your roof by 15 years or more. And even if you think your roof is at the end of its life, 90% of the time, RoofMax can extend the life of your roof by five years at a fraction of the cost of a new roof. So give us a call and we'll give you a free assessment to see if your roof qualifies. Well, horse lovers from around the country are gathering in Madison today. More than 50,000 are expected to attend the Midwest Horse Fair through the weekend. Our Braden Ross is there this afternoon to show us what you can expect if you're able to make it out this weekend. Hi, Braden. Yes.
Yes, hi guys. We are here inside the Coliseum here at the Alliant Energy Center where the main event tonight is going to happen. And I'm actually joined by two of the performers that are going to perform in this event, Bethany and Ryder. Tell me a little bit about what you guys do in the rodeo tonight. That's the main event. Yeah, so we're kind of like the halftime show. We're one of the specialty acts here. This event's really unique because most rodeos will feature maybe one specialty act, and this one has five or six specialty acts. So Ryder, um, he's going to trick rope, he's going to crack whips and spin guns, and I'm going to trick ride, which I like to describe as gymnastics on horseback. So I've got a horse that runs really fast around the arena, and I'm going to do handstands and stand up and hang off the side of her. And how long have you guys been doing this? Tell me a little bit about yourselves and where you're from. Yeah, so I'm fifth generation horse trainer in my family, and she's actually, this is like, her mom and dad never did it, so she learned how to trick ride and thought it was a good idea to hang off a running horse. But I, uh, man, I've always grown up watching Roy Rogers and the silver screen cowboy and wanting to be a cowboy when I grew up. So I always loved the trick roping and the gun spinning. And I mean, it's taken me around the world. I performed in every state in America and 15 other countries. And, you know, coming here, I did this show when I was uh, like 11 years old. And coming back, it's, it's really cool because this is honestly Barnes Pro Rodeo. They bring in some of the best stocks, best livestock. And like she was saying, the performers, they got some great performers. So tell me, you, you have a little bit of a sneak peek for us. Show me a little bit of what people can see here tonight. Brought to Wisconsin as a yearling and arrived with a scraped and bleeding fetlock. And although he'd never been handled outside. Look at that. This is what you can see here tonight if you make it out to the rodeo. That's at 730 here. And this horse fair is going on all weekend here as well. So I think we have one last trick here for you. <laughs> okay, get going. <laughs> Thanks, guys. We'll see you again at 5 and 6 o'clock and give you some more sneak peeks. <laughs> All right. You got well, her. Welcome them to Madison for us. Great job, Braden. Thank you. <laughs> that was fun. Alex has a check of the weather, and boy, if you're going to the farmer's market tomorrow, you're going to need oh. a sweater mm -hmm. and a turtleneck. Yeah, you might want to bundle up in more in winter attire for your Saturday morning than spring attire. Definitely going to might need the hat mittens and something to cover your ears because it's going to be a chilly start to the weekend, at least the start of your weekend. Frost possible also tonight, and again on your Saturday night, a little warmer on your Sunday, and then a little warmer after that. We'll track the temperature changes in some of our other newscasts this evening. First, calling out freeze warning for much of southern Wisconsin. This is for temperatures at 32 or just below 32 degrees. Those tender plants and vegetation, if you have the ability to bring those in tonight, I would encourage that or cover them up, even just to be on the safe side. Those current conditions right now, 49 in Madison. That west wind at 16, oof, puts a little bit of a bite in the air. That dew point, that measure of moisture is 23. This gets a little into the weeds with weather, but that's as cold as the temperature can ever get is the dew point temperature. When it's in the 20s, that means our temperatures can fall into the 20s overnight, but I'm not expecting it to get quite that cold. Again, right around 50 degrees here in Dane County, across the rest of southern Wisconsin, we got a 46 in Camp Douglas right now. The warm spot right now is 54 in Janesville. Let's track those temperatures. Midnight, 36 in Madison, 36 in the Dells, 38 in Janesville. Watch what happens by 4 o'clock. We're down to freezing across much of southern Wisconsin. Then as we head towards that 5, 6 o'clock hour, that's generally when most of the heat from the ground radiates out to space. We're 31 degrees in Madison, 32 in Lone Rock, and 30 in Watoma, 6 o'clock, even just a degree colder. 31 in Lone Rock, 31 in Mineral Point, maybe some places dipping in into the upper 20s out there. 7 o'clock, sun comes up, and then our temperatures start to rise. But all we're going to do is the middle to upper 40s, March temperatures at the end of March. That's weeks ago. That's our temperatures that we will be experiencing on your Saturday. Following Saturday, going on into your Sunday, that frost potential still again Sunday morning. But look at the temperatures on your Sunday, back up closer to 60 degrees. We'll do warmer on your Monday. Some shower chances Monday night going on into your Tuesday. Another chance of frost Wednesday night. This is that season for frost late April, all the way up to about May 15th, generally in southern Wisconsin. Next weekend, first to Warren, we'll talk more about this in the five and the six o'clock shows about our upcoming weekend next weekend potential for alert day conditions for strong storms heavy rainfall and the possibility again of some uh, severe weather even speaking of severe weather flashback this week let's take a look at some of our viewer photos here this one from Monticello Logan Fry showing us this photo coming in from the north and from the west one of those lines of thunderstorms this was the first line of thunderstorms that next photo this is 
modest clouds, very ominous looking skies just a couple of days ago from Muscaday. It's cold now that was warm then. We're replacing the conditions with those thunderstorms is what's getting us to this cold temperatures that we're experiencing right now. Look at that lightning bolt here. Julie sending us this from Sauk City. We have a couple other photos here. Melissa, the morning after the st storm, the sunlight, right? Golden sunshine to end that stormy period across southern Wisconsin. It's just been cloudy and kind of chilly. And now that's leading us into the frost chances that we're going to have here, folks. So again, we always appreciate you sending us those photos there. So once again, appreciate that. Channel3000.com slash weather. Just click the post your own button. We'll see if we can get your photos. <laughs> on air. I love seeing those photos. I do too. They're pretty cool. Well, the weekend is here and that means our favorite film critic is back with a look at what's streaming. Will Loper returns with all the top hits hitting your screen. This is a travel show I'm doing oh, uh, where I visit my fans from around the world. We must embrace the way people do in this country, which is I'm supposed to kiss you, right? You're making it so weird. That's what I do. That's what that is, is my gift. Travel with Conan O'Brien to new lands in Conan O'Brien Must Go, newly streaming on Max. Is this how people dress in, uh, in Norway? Uh, no. One no is fine. Is the name Conan more popular in Ireland since my great fame? You're the only Conan I know. Watch the relationship unfold between two cowboys, played by Ethan Hawke and Pedro Pascal, in the 31-minute short film Strange Way of Life, streaming on Netflix. You never loved me. You never loved anyone in your life. Don't say that. and witness perhaps the greatest cinematic achievement since celluloid was invented with the film Hundreds of Beavers, available to rent or buy on digital platforms. <laughs> Filmed in the North Woods of Wisconsin, Hundreds of Beavers follows an Applejack salesman trying to survive the cold catch some rascally rabbits, and quite possibly become the greatest fur trapper that ever lived. Hundreds of beavers can be rented for $5.99 on Amazon or iTunes now. For Live at Four, I'm Will Loper. I'm interested in that. <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah. Thank you, Will. In Stoughton, a new art exhibition is looking to wow and amaze anyone who enters. It's featuring more than 20 artists, with the majority being from Wisconsin, and they're all being judged against each other. The exhibition is called Wandering in Nature. It opens today at 5 o'clock with a reception. The juried show is pitting the 22 artists against each other to try and hone their craft. Curation was um, on realism and abstract, um, all contemporary works, and then we have some screen printing, some woodblock prints, and some wool wool art. So it's we got a really wide range of artwork here. The gallery is open from tonight until June 2nd at the Overt Space Gallery and Gift. Tomorrow is National Record Store Day, and Madison has a plethora of shops to get your vinyl. Whether it's vintage or fresh off the press, these independent businesses have been churning out the hits for years. This is a day for the people who make up the record store. Everyone from the customers to the recording artists are celebrating. Record Store Day sparked the revival and um, we were about ready to give up before that happened and it just feels like an amazing almost a miracle that physical media is back. You can help support local record shops by buying some vinyl tomorrow for yourself or maybe mm -hmm. for someone else. Well, coming up next on Live at 4, State Street is getting more colorful. We'll bring you an inside look at a new project this weekend that will bring some life to pavement. That's coming up next when Live at 4 returns. What can our phone do for your home? Incredible comfort, no matter what the weather. Incredible savings, because your AC is going to run so much less. It even reduces outside noise and allergens. <laughs> No matter what kind of cheap insulation you already have, our foam will go right over it. Incredible. 
And spring is the time for incredible deals. So we're matching the $1,200 tax credit with a $1,200 discount. USA Insulation. Fjords has been crafting beautifully designed functional furniture since 1941. Every aspect of Fjords furniture has been carefully engineered to create a higher level of relaxation. Visit the Century House today and view our extensive lineup. Experience the unmatched relaxation you can only achieve in Fjords furniture. Relaxation made beautiful. Visit the Century House at 3420 University Avenue in Madison or online at centuryhouseinc.com. No two people are exactly alike. While I can make my coffee just right for me, I can't customize everything. Take health insurance, for example. Original Medicare is just basic coverage, and it's the same for everyone. It didn't cover all of my health care needs or provide all the benefits I wanted. That's why I called Anthem Blue Cross and Blue Shield about their Medicare Advantage plans. With one call, they helped me find a Medicare Advantage plan that's like my morning coffee, just right for me. I was able to find a Medicare Advantage plan with additional benefits like dental, vision, prescription drug coverage, and more. But I couldn't have gotten those additional benefits if I didn't call. I spoke to an Anthem Blue Cross and Blue Shield licensed insurance agent that listened to my needs and treated me like family. They helped me find a plan with all the benefits I need, and they can help you too. The call is free, and there's no obligation to enroll. If you just turned 65, recently moved, or lost coverage, you may be eligible for a plan today. Don't settle for basic coverage. Call now to find a plan with more benefits like dental, vision, and prescription drug coverage. You know, with my old plan, I was missing out on some things I really needed. I heard that new plan options were available for 2024, so I called. I couldn't believe what they had to say. You might just be a little surprised yourself. They even helped me find a plan that lets me keep all of my doctors and specialists. If you're looking for more coverage that fits your needs and your budget, give Anthem Blue Cross and Blue Shield a call today. They'll help you find a plan that's right for you, just like you made it yourself. Call now. You may be eligible to enroll in a plan today, but you won't know unless you take action. Call 800-916-6140. That's 800-916-6140. 800-916-6140. Call now. Well, calling all artists. Do you like to draw or paint or anything like I'd that? I'd like to. I don't know if it's any good, but I try. <laughs> That's how I feel, too. <laughs> the city of Madison is inviting artists to leave their mark on State Street this Sunday. It's part of a community painting event. Oh, we can practice. Yes. <laughs> well, it's an experiment to turn the 400 and 600 blocks of State Street into a pedestrian mall this summer. James Langer is the public information officer with the uh, in the Department of Planning and Economic Development for the City of Madison. James, can you hear us out there? You can hear me. I can't hear oh, anything. Oh, there he is. Can't hear anything. Hi, James. Can you can you hear us? Well, oh. you know what? Sometimes <laughs> those things happen. Yep. Yeah, well, so we'll see if we can fix that and and get back. To yeah, James. yeah. So we have a big tease, and then. Uh, <laughs> You'll just have to wait. <laughs> All right, well, uh, we will try to fix that and we'll be right back. Most window companies only talk about their promotional offers. Next door and window prefers to talk about their products. Ultrax fiberglass windows are eight times stronger than vinyl and won't warp in extreme weather. Fiberglass frames are thin and strong, so you get bigger, more beautiful views. The sun won't fade the finish of Ultrax, so your home will look beautiful for years to come. Why buy vinyl when you can install fiberglass windows from Nextdoor and Window? 50% off installation on windows and doors. Visit nextwindow.com. I'm Clint. I'm Phil. Save you big time money on water. 32 packs of Niagara purified water or Chippewa spring water. $3.69 each or two for $7. Hi, Karama. Hot, hot prices on water. $3.69 or two for $7. We buy in truckloads. No one beats our price. Better, better products, better prices, better, better service because we're employee owned. It's good men's. Update your floors with Empire Today's $50 room sale. Buy one room, get floors for all other rooms for just $50 each. So when you buy one room, it's only $50 for laminate in the kitchen, $50 for carpet in the bedroom, 
and $50 for hardwood in the office. There's no limit. Buy one room and it's $50 for floors in each additional room. Schedule now. 800-588-2300-EMPIRE Today. Why choose between that new deck you've been wanting and that vacation you've been dreaming about? Get both. A deck that outlasts wood three to one and up to a seven-day vacation on one of the top cruise lines or at one of our hundreds of resorts with no blackout date restrictions. Call now or visit the website for your new deck today. Let's hit the road. The road to winning at Wild Rose Casino and Hotel Clinton, Iowa. You're just a short drive away from a weekend full of fun, food, and winning. Plenty of slots calling your name, table games too. Or watch and wager on the games in our DraftKings Sportsbook. There's something for everyone at Wild Rose Casino and Hotel Clinton. You'd rather be here. With Sweeto Metal Roofing, you get quality metal roofs installed by the best in the business. A metal roof means no fading, no storm repairs, true sustainability, and lower energy bills. Sweeto Metal Roofing, the last roof you'll ever need. News 3 Now First Worn Weather is brought to you by Lazy Boy Home Furnishings and Decor. Discover a shopping and design experience as comfortable as the furniture. Lazy Boy Home Furnishings and Decor. Schedule your free design consultation today. You're watching News 3 Now, live at 4. All right, let's give this another try. <laughs> let's go out live to James Langer out on State Street. James, can you hear us now? We can, Ooh. yeah. How's it going, guys? Good, how are you? I'm doing great. We have a great event coming up this weekend. I can't wait to talk to you guys about Yeah, tell us all about this community painting project on Sunday. Yeah, so this is something we're really excited about. So, you know, everybody is really excited about this pedestrian mall experiment that the city is going to do on the uh, 400 to 600 blocks of State Street. Uh, if you're unfamiliar, it's between about Gorham down that way all the way down to just about before Library Mall. Um, so what we're going to do is eventually close down this stretch, make it a pedestrian mall, but before then, uh, we're actually going to do some de decorating and, and folks have a chance to do that. So we put out a call for volunteers and more than 600 people actually signed up to take part in helping us paint this area, which is really cool and really exciting. Now, what is, yeah. the, what is the greater vision about making this a pedestrian mall? It's kind of an experiment, right? It is, yeah. It's something that we're going to try this summer, see how it goes, and then kind of go from there. So aside from the art on the street, we're going to have some more planters installed. We're going to have benches that are wrapped with art. We're even going to have giant six-foot-tall flamingos at the entrance of State Street. The idea to kind of really turn it into an attraction and get people down here and just kind of enjoy the space, see all the shops that are down on this part of State Street. And, you know, we'll have entertainment through the summertime, too, as well. So some music, some other events going on. So really just kind of making this a great congregating place down on State Street. And we see some of those colorful circles behind you. And with everything that you've mentioned, is the hope just to make this interactive uh, for people so they can, I guess, have some sort of investment in it. Yeah, absolutely. I think this is what's really cool about this is that we're inviting the entire community to have a part in this and leave their mark on State Street, right? It's something really cool that you can say, you know, if you're a part of this, that, hey, I had a hand in, you know, painting this corner of State Street, or every time you walk past it, you're going to get that reminder. And I think that's really cool that so many people are going to have a chance to really, you know, literally have a hand <laughs> in this part of the community. It's really awesome, and I can't wait for Sunday. No, I agree. I can't wait to go down and see when it's all done, what everybody created. But if you're watching this afternoon and you want to participate, you do have to sign up for this, right? Yeah, yeah, we had registration. And actually, the, the response was so overwhelming, we actually had to close registration after about a day and a half or two days. Uh, more than 600 people signed up. So, um, you know, our, our painting spots are all filled up. But if you want to still come down and check it out, State Street, the 400 to 600 blocks are going to be packed with people on Sunday from 10 to 3. Come check it out. Just take some pictures. Um, tell your friends about it. Or, you know, we're, we're getting ready to really open up State Street or 
or close it down, I should say, to traffic in the next couple of weeks. So first full week in May is kind of what we're aiming for in, in terms of getting the whole experience together. This is just the first step. Oh, very cool. What a cool project. Yeah. James, it's so great to see you. Thanks yeah. for rolling with things. James used to work with us, so yeah, we it's miss so great him. to see you. This is going to be an exciting <laughs> project. Absolutely. Good to talk to you guys. Okay, you see you this weekend. Well, speaking of, after a beautiful weekend last oh. week, ooh, it's that a little nice. chilly and yeah. it's brisk outside. Nice to look at from in here. Well, our weather words today are tracking frosty mornings. Alex, what's going on with that? Yeah, yeah, so for those plants downtown, at least you have kind of that urban heat that gives off enough of that heat. Hopefully, will keep those plants downtown from getting too much frost on it. But if you're out in low-lying areas, out in open spaces, we have freeze warnings in effect until 8 o'clock on your Saturday morning. So you might want to pull in those tender plants or cover them up tonight just to keep them on the safe side as those temperatures are going to go right down to that critical junction. 31 degrees in Lone Rock, 31 in Madison, 31 in Platteville, 32 in Baraboo. Look at Camp Douglas, 30 degrees. So it's just getting right below freezing where we run into the potential for that frost. I'll step away here just a little bit. Look at that chilly Saturday. All we're going to do is 49 degrees. That's normal high temperatures for the last part of March. And then as we carry on into your Sunday, when we have that event downtown, much, much improved conditions. Temperatures approaching 60 degrees out there. So the nicer of the two days is Sunday, which will eye up just nicely for that event. 49 in Madison right now, 54 in Janesville, 51 in Lone Rock here in Dane County. Let's see if I can find the warm spot here. 52, 52, you're the warm spot. Oh, I lied. 53 here in Edgerton. Otherwise, upper 40s, right around 50 degrees across southern Wisconsin. Again, these are temperatures you normally would be looking at at the end of March. Here at the Capitol, it looks pretty. It's kind of that deceptive sunshine outside because you got those west winds sustained at 16 miles per hour. That's a hint right there. With our temperature at 49 degrees, we'll see those temperatures fall tonight. I gave you the hint. Coming up in my next weather, we're going to talk about one ingredient that may help keep that frost from being very widespread. I have all those information, kind of quiz almost, <laughs> coming up. All right, Alex, thank you. A former Sauk Prairie police officer is in court for his sentencing today. Joe Ludowitz is charged with attempting to cover up a crash involving his car. The charge is from an incident on December 30th, 2022. Ludowitz's car ended up totaled at the bottom of a 30-foot embankment on the Great Sauk State Trail without a driver. Well, the morning after the crash, Ludowitz reported his car stolen when someone called police reporting they'd found the car. Ludowitz was one of the first officers to arrive on scene. The sheriff's office investigated and found Ludowitz's dash cam footage, which showed him removing things from his car and wiping off blood. He's pleaded not guilty to the charge and has since resigned. Vice President Kamala Harris is visiting Wisconsin next week to talk about abortion. Ahead of her visit, two women with the Biden campaign campaign spoke about their personal experiences seeking abortion care after Roe was overturned. Political reporter Will Keneally has more. Will? Well, abortion continues to be a key focus area for Democrats heading into the fall election. And the Biden-Harris campaign is having two spokespeople tour Wisconsin as they make their pitch to voters. Now, Amanda Zorowski featured in a recent Biden campaign ad. She lives in Texas and struggled to get care under the state's abortion restrictions. Now, she sat down with us to talk about her experience. It took three days for my life to be considered uh, at risk enough that I could get health care, and I went into septic shock twice, um, nearly died, was in the ICU for three days, was in um, the hospital for a, a total of a week. Now, as a general reminder, abortion remains accessible here in Wisconsin under a Dane County judge's ruling. Now, you can see more from our sit-down this Sunday at 1030 on For the Record. Will, thank you. The stock market ended the week with a mixed bag. The Dow Jones rose 211 points, but both the Nasdaq and the S&P fell. The Nasdaq took a steep dive, falling 319 points, and the S&P 500 fell 43. Over a trillion cicadas will emerge in the U.S. later this spring as researchers prepare to experience the scientific phenomenon of two broods. Catherine Merck spoke with entomologists at UW-Madison about how this will add to their collection. 
Cicadas are going to swarm southern Wisconsin in the coming months, and etymologists at the University of Wisconsin-Madison say it'll be a rare sight to see. We only have so many opportunities in our entire life to see these insects emerge in the badger state. PJ Leash is the director of the UW-Madison Insect Diagnostic Lab. He says the emergence of the periodical cicadas in this brood come every 17 years in Wisconsin, mostly on the southern part of the state. Other parts of the country will experience another brood as well, and that should create a noisy spring. The last time that these two particular groups of insects emerged at the same time was over 200 years ago, as back in 1803, when Thomas Jefferson was president and Lewis and Clark hadn't even started their expedition to the West Coast. Inside the labs at the university, some of the top researchers in the country study the specimens they've collected, and the upcoming natural event will add to it. Reporting in Madison, I'm Katherine Merck, News 3 Now. Coming up next on Live at 4, the Badger Beat returns. This week we're checking out the story of some badgers competing in the Special Olympics. That's next when Live at 4 returns. Welcome to Oakmont Senior Community in Verona. Active seniors 55 plus will enjoy our new luxury apartments professionally managed by award-winning Attic Angel Community. Call Demery today for a tour and reserve your place at Oakmont. April showers bring May flowers, but do your tire gutters risk basement flooding? To the rescue, Fry Construction. Our absolute gutter system is custom fabricated on site for a perfect seamless fit. It's engineered to outperform. Looking for a break in the clouds? How about a sunny 24% discount on our absolute gutter system? To get this deal, visit FryConstruction.com today to schedule a full roof replacement. My dry eyes made me a burning, stinging five times a day. Makeup smearing, drops user. I want another option. That's not another drop. Tirvaya, it's not another drop. It's the first and only nasal spray for dry eye. Tirvaya treats the signs and symptoms of dry eye disease fast by helping your body produce its own real tears. Common side effects include sneezing, cough, and throat and nose irritation. Relying only on drops? Not me. My own real tears are my relief. Ask your eye doctor about Tear Via. When a crane collapsed during construction of a major league sports stadium, three workers lost their lives. Their widows called us. When maintenance workers were permanently injured by an industrial accident at a public utilities power plant, the seven injured workers called us. When a factory exploded, injuring dozens of workers, 18 victims, including all three families of men who lost their lives, called us. Because Wisconsinites know who to call when it's a must-win scenario. They call Habish, Habish, and Rotier. National reputation, hometown service. Check this out. The newest fantasy game from DraftKings. Just pick between two and six players and choose if they're going to have more or less of a stat. They compete against others for cash prizes. It's that simple. Okay, let's try it. Do you want more Kevin Hart or less Kevin Hart now? No, don't answer that. Download the Pick 6 app today and score up to $200 back in Pick 6 credits if you don't win your first pick set. The crown is yours. What? Welcome to Oakmont Senior Community in Verona. Active seniors 55 plus will enjoy our new luxury apartments professionally managed by award-winning Attic Angel Community. Call Demery today for a tour and reserve your place at Oakmont. New at 5, a woman's body is found near Peace Trail in Janesville. We will have the latest developments and insights from investigators on this homicide. You might want to consider bringing in or covering your tender plants this weekend. I'm tracking frost chances and also giving you a heads up of the next possibility of alert day conditions at 5. And ahead at 6, some Wisconsin residents are buzzing to hear the cicada invasion this summer with trillions of visitors. What do entomologists hope to discover from this rare phenomenon? That's tonight on News 3 Now at 6. Welcome back everyone. Every Friday on Live at 4, we highlight some issues and events that are happening on the UW-Madison campus. We call it the Badger Beat and our Badger Beat reporter Meryl mm -hmm. Hubbard is here. So hi Meryl and hi, what's Meryl. the latest? Hi Brady and Susan. So this week I posted a story on our Badgers for Special Olympics competing in their basketball tournament. And I think you'll see it's really more than just a game. Hi Badgers, I'm here at the Baki for the Special Olympics Basketball Tournament. The first game of the day is Wisconsin versus Iowa. 
It's the start of another game for our unified Badgers, and our not-so-silent assassin is making moves. Because I'm a very quiet person. He wouldn't hardly talk to anybody before. You know, when gameplay comes, I become a whole different animal and become an assassin out there. On or off the court, everyone here has come together for something special. It's more than just a game. You know, Special Olympics is all about, you know, meeting new people. Really, you get to see these different perspectives on life. I've been doing things at Special Olympics probably since I was five. My aunt had Down syndrome, so I've been around it since since I can remember. I look forward to Special Olympics every single week. It's highlight my week, highlight my day, every single day. No matter where you look, there's highlights all around. He just told me he was proud of me. I love my dad. He's my best friend. I'm so happy he got to come. Just like JoJo, Dan also shares a unique love for his father. He had a hard childhood because his father was so ill his whole life and he never hesitated to help his dad he he was always very supportive of helping his father and then when his father passed away it was like he went into a shell and so special olympics drew him out you know at first it kind of seems overwhelming and then more you just go to one event it seems overwhelming and you go more and more this starts to feel like another home my son may be special needs, but out on that court, he's not. He is his own person, and it draws him out so he is just like anybody else. You know, that's what Special Olympics is all about, is, you know, friendships and bonding with more people and get your skills better. Oh, I love that. I do, too. <laughs> well... Did they win the game? They did not win. <laughs> it was very, very close. But even though they didn't, I, I don't know. They were just very supportive, and I don't think it was really about winning for them. You no, know? I so. love the silent assassin. <laughs> yes. It's <laughs> great. Yes, he was very talkative with me, which I was really happy about. But usually they say that he's a little more to himself. Yeah. So it seems like he's just coming more and more into himself and becoming more confident. Came out of so. wonderful. Yeah. yeah. Thank you, Meryl. Thank, Thank you so you. much. We'll see you next week. Yes. When will we come back for better or worse? She is one of the most decorated, famous, and perhaps infamous comedians in the world. Emmy and Grammy winner Kathy Griffin is on tour and making a stop in Madison. Coming up after the break, she's talking with us about hitting the road after nearly seven years of controversy and health setbacks. Join Dr. Ashish M. Ravel on May 2nd at 5.30 p.m. to learn about the causes of shoulder pain and pain relief options. To register for the free online educational talk, visit StoughtonHealth.com and click on Classes and Events. It's replacement window season. Do you have ugly, hard-to-open, drafty windows? Now is the best time to buy new Champion windows, because when you buy two, you get two free. Buy two Champion windows, get, get two, two free? free? I guess that means if you buy four, you get, you get four, four free. free. Buy six, get, get six, six free. free. Buy 10, get, get 10, 10 free. free. Hurry, Champions Buy Two, Get Two Free sale is for a limited time. Great job, everybody. Thanks. Thanks. Call 888-4-CHAMPION or schedule your free in-home estimate online today. Sure, you can come for the fun. But you'll stay for the food. And the brews. And of course, our famous fish fry. And it's all right here at the Middleton Sport Bowl, one of Middleton's original neighborhood bar and grills with daily lunch, dinner, and drink specials. Middleton Sport Bowl on University Avenue, just east of Park Street. Wisconsin. Lottery retailers all around the state are lighting up with the latest limited time offer. It's all or nothing bonus days. During the month of April, all or nothing players have a one in seven chance to receive a $2 bonus ticket for the next midday drawing. 
This electric offer is only available for a limited time and only at Wisconsin Lottery Retailers. Nobody wants to put a new roof over their head. It's too expensive. And if they can extend the life of that roof and get five more years or 10 more years, it's a no-brainer. What RoofMax does is it helps people in that they don't have to spend that $15,000, $20,000 on a new roof. They can spend pennies on the dollar. The RoofMax product was a small percentage of cost of replacing a roof. This is a great financial decision for us as a community. Dr. Ravel is one of the best. I mean, you can't ask for any other person in orthopedics that I've ever seen, and I've seen a lot of people in orthopedics, let me tell you. Ortho team and Dr. Ravel are wonderful. From the D-list to the no-fly list, now two-time Emmy winner and Grammy winner Kathy Griffin is on the road again with a new tour called My Life on the PTSD List. The name of her show comes from about seven years of turbulence in her life, including the infamous photo that led to a U.S. Department of Justice investigation, her struggles with addiction, a suicide attempt, and surviving lung cancer. I sat down with her to talk about all of that and why she hopes to make Madison laugh when she stops here on Sunday. Oh my gosh, is that two-time Emmy and Grammy winner Kathy Griffin, star of Suddenly Susan? Let's not forget my Glad Lifetime Achievement Award. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. You've been through enough. I can't believe I did that to you. Can you imagine the trauma? <laughs> Okay, Kathy Griffin, I'm gonna start with the tough question our viewers wanna know. Are you excited to visit Madison, Wisconsin, and will you be getting cheese curds while you're here? First of all, don't act like I haven't been to Madison. <laughs> I'm from Forest Park, Illinois. I'm Madison adjacent. Ooh, Second of all, I'm gonna get so many cheese curds, it's gonna be like I'm on the no-fly list again because they're gonna question me based on my sex, um, delicious <laughs> cheese curds, and yes, I, I don't care what they do to my gastrointestinal system. <laughs> I'll worry about that later. Madison's very excited to welcome you here. This is your first time on the stage. You're in this new tour uh, more than six years after. A lot of stuff has happened, uh, and that's why you titled this My yeah, Life on the PTSD List. Yeah, tell me about that. I mean, it's been a journey. Just the last six and a half years, the Trump photo scandal, which everybody knows about, but, you know, I took a picture of Donald Trump's Halloween mask with ketchup. He got upset. The Department of Justice came after me. So this was a, a cancellation. I was investigated by the Department of Justice, two agencies within the Department of Justice. They put me on the no-fly list. Then they put me on the Interpol list. And they were very seriously considering charging me with a conspiracy to assassinate the president of the United States. All right, so that lost me all my work and most of my friends. And a lot of people in my own industry turned their backs, which really hurt. So guess what I did? I stayed at home and took prescription pills. That's right. I became a junkie at 57. You're welcome, Madison. I saved the good stuff for you. And so I get into recovery and I'm a year and about a month sober and then I get diagnosed with lung cancer and I've never even smoked. So I have half a lung on my left side and I don't like the way you're flaunting your two lungs in my face right now. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah, well, you should have thought that because I'm the face of the one and a half lungs community and our vote matters. And just to throw it in there, Three and a half months ago, I filed for divorce, which nobody does at 63. So I need Madison to give me the good laughs that I want. I want to give you guys two hours. I don't have an opener. It's just me. I have a lot to say. I talk about everything from PTSD to being consoled by Sharon Stone to going to a party at Paris Hilton's where I met Megan Thee Stallion, and she said that she would call me Kathy V. Griffin. I mean, a lot's been going on. Oh, Kathy V. Griffin, you have a lot of good stories to tell. And I know that you are a workhorse. Is it nice to be back at work now and doing what you love to do and making people laugh? You have no idea. I This is going to sound corny. I feel like I'm home. Being out of work for over six years, after being a happy workaholic, I was on my life on the D-list or Suddenly Susan or my Kathy talk show or commercials or hosting award shows, always working, but touring has always been my number one love. You once said you have no limits, no filter, no class, no poise, no decorum, just fun. Is that your life motto? Oh yes, who has time for decorum? I mean, 
You don't want to know what I was doing yesterday. I live in Malibu, mm -hmm. which has given me a whole new slew of celebrities to torture. And yeah, I'm talking to you, Mel Gibson and Gary Busey. <laughs> but yesterday, one of my dogs got out, and I'm running around my property with just a T-shirt and granny panties. And I was like, well, where's the paparazzi now? Because here's the picture. Well, Madison is glad that you said yes to your show here Sunday, April 21st at the Capitol Theater. And you can go to overture.org to get tickets. Kathy, thank you so much. Thank you so much. So much and I can't wait to see you in Madison. Woo. <laughs> well, Kathy Griffin is performing at Carnegie Hall on this tour as well. It'll be her sixth time, which means she's going to break a previous record that was held by her friend, the late Joan Rivers. Sunday night at the Overture Center. Yeah, yeah. I think it'll be a, a, a big crowd there. And bring her some cheese curds. Yeah, yeah. She'll <laughs> like that. Now let's head over to Alex for a check on this brisk forecast. Yes, indeed. You'll have to dress a little bit on the warm side on Sunday evening. Not quite as warm as you're going to have to dress on your Saturday. Frosty conditions, too, are possible tonight and then again on Saturday night. Is that time of year? Is April going right into mid-May where we are going to have to deal with those on and off frost chances? Let's track those temperatures. They will get as low at about 6, 630 in the morning. 31 in Lone Rock, 31 in Madison, 31 in Mineral Point, Camp Douglas, 30 degrees. That's right at that critical temperature where you might want to consider bringing in your plants. In fact, I encourage you to bring in your plants tonight or cover them up if you can. We already have freeze warnings for a good portion of southern Wisconsin. I would not be shocked to see this expanded. And then again, we're going to repeat this as we go on into your Saturday night. The ingredient. Here we go. Kind of that quiz I was leading up to earlier. Gusty winds since midnight, 30, 40, 45, even 50 mile per hour wind gusts today. And what happens at 6 o'clock in the morning is we still have wind gusts approaching 30 miles per hour. The science behind this, those air molecules, they're hitting into each other. Just rub your fingers together. When you rub your fingers together, you have friction. You get heat. So the bombarding of those air molecules from those wind gusts may be just enough to help keep those temperatures at or hopefully just a little bit above freezing to keep some of the frost at bay. So that's something we're going to be keeping an eye on. Will that frost still form with these gusty winds expected? And then ahead, you might be wondering, when's it going to rain next, Alex? Monday going into Tuesday, scattered showers are quite likely. And then as we head out into the following weekend, first warm weather team will track this in the 5 and the 6 and the 10 o'clock shows tonight. Could be looking at alert day conditions as we head into the following end of the upcoming work week in that following weekend with warmer temperatures, heavy rain, and the possibility of strong storms. We'll be back in just a couple of minutes. Harker Heating and Cooling, you can save a whole bunch of money when you buy an air conditioner. You know what's even better? Saving even more money when you purchase an air conditioner and a furnace at the same time. Harker Heating and Cooling. I want you. I want fresh air. <laughs> You need the experts. The Home Renewal Experts at Belco will make your project a breeze with free installation on windows, siding, doors, and roofing. Plus, no interest for six years. Free installation won't last long. Hurry. Call now. Call 866 for Belco. Let's hit the road. The road to winning at Wild Rose Casino and Hotel Clinton, Iowa. You're just a short drive away from a weekend full of fun, food, and winning. Plenty of slots calling your name, table games too. Or watch and wager on the games in our DraftKings Sportsbook. There's something for everyone at Wild Rose Casino and Hotel Clinton. You'd rather be here. This famous wood fence from the show Home Improvement had to have boards replaced 13 times in only nine years. Our fences outlast wood three to one and are all backed by our extensive lifetime warranty. This month, save $1,000 on your project. Visit the website or call the number for your new fence today. At Harker Heating and Cooling, you can save a whole bunch of money when you buy an air conditioner. You know what's even better? Saving even more money when you purchase an air conditioner and a furnace at the same time. Harker Heating and Cooling. New at 5, a woman's body is found near Peace Trail in Janesville. We'll have the latest developments from investigators and get ready to be swept away by the beauty of wandering in nature. We unveil Stoughton's new art exhibition. That's in just a few moments. 
Start your evening with News 3 Now at 6, moving forward, uncovering the stories and getting to the heart of events and issues that matter here. And when bad weather is on the way, we warn you first. News 3 Now at 6, moving forward, weeknights. Well, take a look at this. A group messing with some bear cubs in the wild is sparking anger online. You wouldn't think this would need to be said, but officials in North Carolina are reminding people don't mess with wild animals. This after a group was caught on camera pulling two baby bear cubs from a tree to take selfies with them. One of the cubs is now being treated after it was found lethargic and frightened. The video made the rounds on social media where people t uh, tore into the cub movers worse than even a mama bear could manage. Keep your hands to yourselves. Well, Swifty has got double their pleasure when she secretly released a double album when everyone was expecting just one. Taylor Swift first released her highly anticipated 11th studio album, The Tortured Poets Department, on Friday. The 16-track album appeared on Apple Music before its scheduled midnight release time. Then, when I was done listening to that, you know what, at 2 a.m., <laughs> when I was ready to go to bed, she surprise released an additional 15-song album titled TTPD, The Anthology. <sighs> she is introducing the second album she posted on Instagram. She'd written so much tortured poetry over the last two years, she wanted to share it with everyone. I'm still working my way through that second album, Susan. We'll be right back. Get an 11% rebate on everything. Now at Menards. Finish your project with countertops from Menards. With elegant to everyday options, we carry everything you need to beautify your home's decor. Get your laminate countertop today starting at $29.98 after rebate. Update your home with flooring from Tarkat. From easy to install sheet vinyl, waterproof vinyl plank, to durable laminate flooring. Tarkat has the perfect flooring for you. Aquafloor Premier Laminate Flooring is $2.69 per square foot after 11% rebate. Save big money at Menards. Creating family memories is what Maple Leaf Landscaping is all about. We design and build outdoor spaces that bring people together. Landscaped spaces for any size family. Functional, beautiful, a place everyone will enjoy. And it all starts with a free visit at your home by one of our landscape experts. So call Maple Leaf Landscaping today and have us create an outdoor living space for your home. Megan Tim, Director of Community Health at SSM Health. You may know us as healthcare providers, but we live here too. And as good neighbors, we know our community thrives when we take care of each other. That's why SSM Health and News 3 Now are sharing the keys to health. Watch for our expert information and advice on air, online, and at fun local events. Join SSM Health and News 3 Now, and together, we'll unlock a healthier community by taking time for kids. Yo, you think Dallas is power four gonna drop 30 tomorrow? Why are you tripping? Did you see his mom made a post about going to the game? What? Hold up. Is mama gonna be there? He's been averaging like 34 points a game when she's there. At least 40 when she's down there at He don't like to let his mama down. <laughs> pick more, pick less. It's that easy. Cash in on your sports fandom with prize picks. What can our foam do for your home? Incredible comfort, no matter what the weather. Incredible savings, because your AC is going to run so much less. It even reduces outside noise and allergens. No matter what kind of cheap insulation you already have, our foam will go right over it. Incredible. And spring is the time for incredible deals. So we're matching the $1,200 tax credit with a $1,200 discount. USA Insulation. Coming up next at 5, people at the Dane County Jail are participating in a new program. How it could change their lives, coming up at 5. Thank you, Brady. Thanks for your help today. Have a good weekend, and thank you for watching Live at 4 on this Friday. News 3 Now at 5 starts right now.